Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Mill7 Gaming. We're going to play a little Baldur's Gate 3 today. Uh, you know, this is early access. Versions are changing. Patches are coming out. So I just wanted a quick screenshot here so you guys can see exactly what we're playing on. We're on 4.1.83.6620. And we are on hotfix number three. The previous two hours were on hotfix number two yesterday. So small update. Um, I didn't really have any significant issues. So we'll see how today goes. All right, when we left off, we were unable to open this door. And um, yeah, I kind of skipped the obvious. Um, actually, I'm probably not sure who's the most, the best to do this, but um, attack. <laughs> I mean, we don't have to pick it. All right, there we go. Are we really, are we, whoops, that's not what I'm looking for. I don't want to see, whoops, hold on. I want character, which is N for some reason. Um, and I do not need to be dual wielding. That is not the plan. Not with, not for Mellow. Let's just go with an ax and call it a day. Um, hopefully we're not gonna be doing a lot of smacking things with a, a weapon, a hand weapon at all, but that is the deal. Let me hit F5 so we don't die going through this room and I forget. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab her. Uh, you know, we probably could use some healing, but you know what? We are out of spells for her as well. Well, we're just going to give it a try. Oh, whoops, is the door not? Oh, nope, it is. Okay. Uh, anything there? Candles. May as well light them. All right, get a little bit of light going. Is this one unlocked? It is. This place wasn't built for the living. All right, explore the ruins. Ah, I'll take a couple, take a couple scrolls. Are they worth it? I'll take the cup. I guess we have to right click and pick up. It's worth 10 and has no weight. So, you know. Um, just in case a fight happens, let's make sure we get a little bit of light in here. Uh, looks like there is a gilded chest over there. Let's go ahead and kick that open. And we might as well take it all. I say it weighs nothing and it, it it's worth something, so... Uh, are there candelabras over here? Yes. I'm just going to make sure we light up this room. I think there's probably enough light that it's not going to be an issue, but um, like I say, if I end up having a fight in here, I would rather not... Oh, we have a thief, don't we? Do we have any sort of... Hmm, who has our best perception, do we think? Whoops. N. Uh, let's look at character panels. There we go. Perception is going to be under what? Wisdom. All right. Ah, uh, so no perception bonus there at all. Plus four for Asterion. Three for Shadowheart. So you are going to be our dude. That makes sense. He's got dark vision. Um, does the elf get any bonuses towards trap detection? Not seeing anything. Okay. Might be dwarfs that get that. All right. So I'm actually going to split him off for the moment. Let's let's use that deal here. I've got to start playing this. Oh, What's that? where of gas pits with spew surface cover them with sufficiently heavy objects. That's not what I want to do. No, we're, we're already sitting. Can I? I think we right click. No. 
There's a way to do it. We did it before. No, I don't want to control. Hmm. Now I have to remember how to do that. I'm going to check. Let's go to our options. Let's go to our key binds. Let's see what we can find. Camera rotation, cycle characters, right bracket, left bracket, destruct toggle. That's not what we want. Interact. Not quite. Uh, in turn... Hmm. Now we moved that box earlier. I don't think we had to do anything crazy to do it. I thought I just left clicked and drug it. So I'm gonna try that. Does not appear to be working. But if they give us a warning like that, that means there needs to be something on it. And it may just be that that's just too heavy for us to move. Um, is there a... Maybe this... Oh, maybe with this... This one looks bigger. Ah, oh, there we go. Now, see, this one, it lets me move. Okay. Yeah, we just left-click and, and drag it where we want it. I'm going to go ahead and walk there, and then we'll... We'll drag to there. Now, realistically, it's on feet, so it's probably not going to stop much. But let's see if, uh, I'm assuming, no, that's not quite right. Can I get, I don't know how, like, good I have to get it. Okay, it can't be too much more. Looks about as good as we're going to get it. So let's see what happens. Let's uh, F5. So I'm assuming that something is going to trigger that. It's a plaque. The text on the plaque is a mystery to you. Um, I'm going to kind of look around. Oh, there's another one there. I'm just kind of thinking before I interact with stuff. Hmm. There's a box there. Are we symmetrical? Oh, we failed, but I bet there's still one there. It made the check. All right, so we've got one here and one here, and I'm assuming one here and one here. We've got a couple boxes here. So we can at least cover these two. Move this box to here for now. There's another door in the back there. I could have put it on that vent too. Um, hmm. I'm guessing if one's trapped, it's going to be this one. I wonder, can we drag sarcophagus tops? No. I'm going to light a light. Again, in case I have to fight in here. Oops. Hmm. So we've got three of the five potentially covered. Nothing else really in here to drag. I don't think of. I don't think a vase is gonna work. But we're gonna. It turned yellow when we did it, so we're going to pretend that that means something. Can we move that little guy? No. How about this? Nope, that one's too heavy too. Ah, here we go. Go to here. Hmm. 
Put it on top of that. Whoops. And we're just going to kind of put this one here. Kind of right there where we think there's one. Okay, is there another? Oh, we've got a vase on that one already. So I think we've got everything. Now, I'm guessing if it's something, it's there. But I'm going to kind of move over here and we're going to check this one first. A battle axe. Ooh. It's worth a lot and only weighs two. I'm going to take that. I'm not going to... Um, I'm not going to worry about that. We're just looking for goods. It may be that we're going to... Another Onyx ring. We've already taken one. Ringmail armor. We don't have anybody that can wear it at the moment. But if we find our fighter again... I'm... I'm assuming the Gith Yankee is out there. We just haven't found her. They've, they've invested too much into her. Oh. Okay. This is where I think it all goes wrong, guys. <laughs> what is this button? Oh, oh, let's push the button. It won't move. How disappointing. Okay. Maybe it turns the trap off. What do we get? The Watcher's Guide and Engraved Key. I wonder if that opens the door down at the bottom that we originally couldn't get in. Oh, this is probably the trap. Uh, I'm going to run that way. Are we, we into turns and it let me leave. Oh, there we go. So what do we think? Nothing is happening with that. Do we think there was some sort of gas or oil maybe? It said, it's, it said gas or liquids, right? So something that would be flammable that would set those off. Now my question is, I'm wondering now is if I can get over there to push the button to turn it off. I don't think it matters, but let's just for the moment. Appreciate the beauty and I'm going to turn me off. In case I want to get a screenshot of this. I'm going to let one more go past so I don't have the mouse in the way. There we go. I mean, it's easy to get out of the shot, but that's pretty cool. I like that. Now I can get a shot of it when I'm editing. Um, Let's turn me back on and get back into the game. There we go. No, no, don't go in there. Don't go in there. Let's get up, up to here. Stick you back on. I think we I think we did okay with that. Except there was one other door in there that I can't get to now. Oh, damn it. Now I've got to. Okay, you. Let's see if we can do this. Uh, so they go so if we can go wait for it to go go to here wait for it to go go to here and I don't know why I had to move to the side but it does appear to shut everything down All right, so now I'm going to grab everybody and we're going to check out this door and I'm going to light that too. Oh, and there's another fossil I didn't see. Um, we're, and we're again, oh, can we not attack? Oh, he can lockpick it. Let's see what happens. Oh, this is the door. Okay, well, let's go back in. Now we know, now we know the loop. Okay. Yeah, we did that right. I don't do these things right very often, guys. Let's just... Oh, can we open the door? There we go. Somebody else tried to get a perception roll on that thing, and we still didn't find it. All right, now how about this door? 
Is it unlocked? Why, yes, it is. And we're going to do kind of... Oh, well, this one's going to let us... I'm going to at least come in the entryway with everybody. Scribes with swords? So much for the quill being right here. Um... I wonder what was so subversive about their words that they commanded protection. We'll lead with the, 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 this looks less like a trap and more like an encounter room. Maybe a trap that launches an encounter? I don't know, we'll find out. Uh, burning hands and a quarter staff. I don't, eh, we'll take it. I mean, we could look at, um, we, oh yeah, well, first of all, let's see what the watcher's guide is. Uh, uncommon two-headed melee weapon. Okay, we don't really have anybody for a spear at the moment. When the spear misses its target, the wielder's next attack against that target is made with advantage. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, I don't really have a two-hander to use it right now. I'm wondering if maybe we give the quarterstaff to um, to our wi wizard here. He's already got he's already got one. Never mind. Never mind. Um, I gave us a ring before, right? A dark ring. Um, do we have? I saw somebody else briefly say that they had an additional ability because of theirs. They got a spell or something. I'm not seeing anything, so that one probably doesn't do anything. It might have been a necklace. I don't know. I was trying to watch a little bit of, of coverage today. I had to go to the vet. I had to take my cat to the for an emergency room visit. And uh, they don't let you in the side anymore. They come out and get the animal and you have to sit in the parking lot. So I was trying to watch some on my phone. Um while BSing with a friend and um, a great club. Okay, another big melee weapon. I don't think we need that. I like the axe for him. I like a hand axe. It's a nice, it suits the kind of, I think it's a better look for him. I mean, we could go, we could give him a torch in the other hand, right? Can we, can we give him a torch in the other hand? We don't want to dual wield though. Oh, it remains until fully rested. Oh, that's really nice. So I just want to carry this. I don't want to hit with it. Now, I thought there was a... Oh, there we go. We're, we're one-handed versus... There. I just want to carry it. Can we light it? I bet we have to dip it. If we dip it in fire, I bet that works. We'll have to give that a try here in a second. Um... All right. Let's go back to just the regular everybody equipment um we can find it i like i like this with everybody's spells that's actually pretty cool all our cantrips all of our level one level two so actually we have a couple level ones we could still do on her it looks like okay actions cantrips whatever this this shows up as level one but that's an ability not a can I drag it up? It's not really a can't. Okay, bonus action. Oh, okay, because we do have that other one equipped. That's fine. Um, that's his special ability. Okay, well, I'm still... Let's just hit I. Will that get us what I'm looking Yeah, okay. So, let's go ahead... Hmm. I should have thought he would get rapier proficiency. Oh, it's probably because of him, because we're on him. Right? So if we click over to here, now what does it say? There we go. I was going to say he should already have it, but he's already using one, so that's fine. Um, and we've got the battle axe. His weight's still reasonably okay. I'll slide the battle axe over to here. She's... Here, let's just... Um, I think, isn't there a remove from where's? Send to camp. I'm not sure what happens if we send it to camp. Is that where we send stuff that we're not actually want to carry, but we want to sell? Um, this might be a mistake, but I'm going to try this. I'm going to go send to camp.
This might be a horrible, horrible mistake, but we'll just do this. I've got a mosquito. He just went buzzing up very close to me. Do you have any more plates that I want to send? We got some cups. We'll just kind of send some of this extra stuff. Um... Toss all the gold on our main dude. This is... A wizard scroll. Well, I guess that kind of is too. Um... You probably don't need them at all. I'll send some of them over here. If you run out of spell slots, we're going to want something for you to do. All right, so I think that makes sense. Oh, we had a disarm kit. I wonder if we could have disarmed that. Maybe if we would have gone to the wall, we would have seen it. Or maybe if we were good enough, we would have got the perception roll on the sarcophagus itself. That's entirely possible. Uh, we'll leave her with that. That seems a very cleric-y thing to do. Um... And we'll send that over there. Oh, we got another plate to send to the camp. And again, I don't know... I don't know if we're going to lose that stuff or not. So I'm just going to kind of do that with it. Um, but that gets our weight down more. His is still a little high. Um, that weighs 18. That weighs 5. Let's send that over there. So he's at... Oh, she's got a lot more weight that she can carry. She can carry 70. So she's got 40 left, 20 left, 20 left, 20 left. Eh. Now, this ring. Um, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to put on all the stupid stuff that we shouldn't try. I'm going to try it on our warlock. I think that's what I'm going to do. Uh, we don't need the perfume. I'm going to send that to, um, to camp too. There we go. All right. And then over here, I click here, and now can I equip it? And then if we go to character sheet, we can see what we got going on. We got anything? There went that mosquito again. Um, I don't know why we had mosquitoes. It's getting cold. I'm not sure why the mosquitoes came out when it got cold. I noticed there was a few flying around last night, too. Um, okay, so I'm not seeing anything extra that's popped up, so we haven't got any special abilities out of it. But we have two, we have a dark ring and an onyx ring and a silver locket. Okay. I can hit F5 so we don't have to do any of that mess again. Um, anything in that? I don't really expect anything to be in them, but, um, granite bench, just been tipped over. Okay, so... We can go that way. Uh, we can go back there. Um, let's walk down and see if we get some idea from here. Oh, I need to flip back to the... Oh. Oh, religion. There we go. She got it. Jurgle. I don't know who Jurgle is. Um, but she knows. There's a plaque in there. Inscription is in a language unknown. To well, we didn't make that check. <laughs> um, this. Ooh, okay, that looks like it just goes there, whereas this might go somewhere. So I'm going to try to kind of clear this room, I guess. And again, I'm going to go back to here and we're going to grab our rogue again. And again, it's dark, so our, our warlock and our mage can't see back there. Our wizard can't see back there anyway. Oh, that reminds me. Hold on. Before we go too far, let's grab him. And let's find some fire. Can we light that? I'm going to light this brassiere. Now I want to... Dip? Well, the, the axe is flaming too, which seems like that's probably a bad idea, but um, we'll throw him back in there. All right. Now let's grab him. Oh, he's already back here. All right, nothing kicked off our... Oh, a button. 
Ah, oh, it wasn't a door. Oh, okay. It, it looked like, I mean, there's an arch there. I just assumed in the dark that it was, and it wasn't. Uh, okay. Well, a trap that became an encounter, or at least a door that became an encounter. I don't know if we were safe for leaving our people out or not. I'm going to drag him back to the rest. Um, we'll go ahead and run him back out. Uh, he has a bow, I think. Can we get a shot? Only 30%, but, you know, something's better than nothing. Uh, our cleric might be able to turn undead. Oh, that's, that's bad. All right, you have to die. Uh, I'm going to walk you forward. And then... Well, we did something. Not a lot, but we did something. Um, man, our wizard is in bad shape. Uh, but he's going to have to... We'll have to heal him with the cleric. Um, yeah. Oh, and then we missed. And then we missed. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to run away. Can I use a potion too? Oh, I can. Perfect. All right. All right. So move, attack, bonus action. We did fine. All right. We got somebody else up here. Is he going to cast spells at us too? Uh, uh, that's not good. I don't know if she needs to talk to turn undead. Um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to walk to here. That gets three in. Hold on, let's let's go up a little bit. Whoops. Let's go up just a little bit further. I kind of want to get that guy in. Now let's do a turn undead. There we go. Um, and I guess we just click us. Uh, does it say? We got one. Okay, we got one. That's well, that's better than nothing. Um, and I'm going to continue to run her up here. She can go after that. That one's running away from us. It didn't say I got turned, though, so he's just moving for strategic advantage. Got a miss there. Oh, put to sleep. That kind of sucks. Um, no, we want to go back to our normal attack. Um, that's not very good. Do we have a special ability? Sneak attack. Um, you have advantage or another enemy of the target. Well, he's within 1.5. Is it still going to give it to me? He is silenced. Oh, but we didn't, we didn't finish him. Uh, can we shove after that? Oh, I like that. I like that. I saw that combo in one of those videos today where they they hit somebody and, and did a shove. All right, and he's turned. All right, so I'm going to come back here. Maybe? Let's see if we can finish this guy off. Oh, Nat 20. She is on it. She says, oh, hell yeah. I'm all for going after uh, the undead. And we start running her up the stairs again. She's got to loop back around that way. Ouch. Those guys are tearing us apart. All right, you're on fire, but you're not in terrible shape. He's dead. I'm wondering about... Um... So we could, that'll double our movement speed. So if I do that, oops. Oh, that was a mistake. I didn't actually mean to do it. We couldn't go that far, but that's fine, I guess. I'm gonna do that. I don't know. Can I? 
I guess we end our turn there. All right, he's awake. Oh, good, good. Um, is he silenced? Muted. Ah. However, looks like I can cast a scroll. Okay, it's something. Uh, I don't know if I can get cover anywhere. That's on fire. I'm just going to go back. Hopefully get out of range. That's kind of my thinking. And then I'll go that way. And we'll end our turn. Now our mage can step out. And then... We do a guiding bolt. Critical hit, another 20, nice, nice, okay. And then we run away, except there's fire there. I don't think that was enough, but that's okay. Um, what if we drink a potion of speed? And then we come up here and hit this dude. Oh, yeah. Um, she doesn't have a heal at this point that she can do, I don't believe. But she can cast a spell? Oh, no, I don't think she needed vision for it. I mean, it only did a point of damage, but it's something. Um, you're still on fire, but otherwise okay. I'll run you up behind her. End your turn. Where's he going? He's coming towards us. Okay. Brave. Um... Hmm. I have a bow. I don't expect it to do much. If I go to here. Oh, I wanted to move, not shoot there. Damn it. Okay, well, let's end that turn. You do not have a bow, but you could potentially get close enough to throw, cast another... Burning hands, animal friendship, burning hands. No, let's just walk you the rest of the way. Oh, this guy's coming back. Oh, that, that really sucks. That really sucks. Let's go, um, nope, that's not what I want. I want help. Okay. Um... Can I jump? What if I jump to here? I still don't have enough to get there. So we'll maybe shoot him. Oh, cause I did the help. So I don't have a, I don't have an action. Oh, that's fine. And now she's going to be confused. Damn it. I'm going to move to here. And now I'm going to shoot him. Only 56%. Yeah. See if we can just close so we can use the uh the regular attack. All right, we've got this. Let's go ahead. Can we do a scroll of burning hands on you? No. We attacked him, but we didn't do a scroll of burning hands. Uh he's down to 2. I mean, it's something. Oh, yeah, put him down with a vengeance. Um, and uh, does she have acid on her right now? No, so I'm just gonna move over to here and I'm gonna hit in turn. And we're gonna walk here and finish him. There we go.
and then somehow she walked back through the acid with one hit point after the fight was over. Not a fan of that, and it really slowed the game down too. So let's see what happens. We're, we're about to wrap up this episode here. We're pretty close to 30 minutes. Okay, and we, we can talk to him as well if and when the game recovers. Might have had a crash. That's not bad. Two and a half hours in for our first legitimate crash on early access. I mean, we're on, what, like day three or four, something like that. We're not... All right, what I will do is, off camera, I will play back up to this point because we saved after we did all our stuff here. So we just have to walk up, trigger that, and then fight again. We already know what the fight is. Um, I will do my best to get through it with everybody alive. Um, maybe not with one hit point. <laughs> we'll have to see how it goes. Um, can we do anything? Nah, it's shot. But anyway, this, this type of stuff is bound to happen in early access. That's why there is early access. So thanks for watching, guys. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you next time. Cheers.